Welcome to Golden Vitality. Did you know there's a vitamin that, when lacking, can cause numbness, sharp pain, and even permanent nerve damage? Yet, when supplemented correctly, it can fully reverse damage, some doctors say is incurable. Today, we're exploring nerve issues and how vitamins can remarkably restore them. Most people think nerve problems, like tingling limbs, sciatica, or pins and needles sensations, are just a natural part of aging, something we must live with and can't change. But what if I told you most nerve issues are simply nutrient deficiencies in disguise? Your body is crying out for specific nutrients to repair and heal itself. Watch this video to the end to learn exactly which vitamin to take for each nerve issue. From tingling limbs to sciatic back pain and the precise dosage to start your recovery today. Let's start with multiple sclerosis, or MS, an autoimmune disease where your immune system mistakenly attacks your nerves and brain. Vitamin D3 acts like a warrior, reducing inflammation in your nerve and brain cells. But for MS, you need very high doses. I'm talking 50,000 to 80,000 IU daily. That's far more than most people expect. I've used vitamin D3 to help put MS into remission, meaning symptoms ease or vanish completely. Research backs this through the Coimbra Protocol, a special high-dose vitamin D3 treatment. I'll link more details below for you to explore. Now, if vitamin D can help a severe autoimmune condition like this, you might wonder what happens when viruses directly attack your nerves. Let's talk about viruses, specifically two, that can invade facial nerves and cause conditions like Bell's palsy. These viruses hide in tiny nerve clusters called ganglia. Think of them as secret hideouts inside your nerves. Viruses are clever. They sneak into these spots to dodge your immune system, like thieves hiding in a basement to avoid the police. Once there, they can shut down a key process called autophagy, your body's way of cleaning up and recycling damaged proteins, bacteria, fungi, and viruses. These viruses lie dormant, waiting for stress to strike. Why? Because stress triggers cortisol, a hormone that weakens your immune system. Emotional stress is the worst. That's why many get shingles or herpes outbreaks after losing a loved one or facing financial strain. When these viruses wake up, they can cause facial issues, fibromyalgia pain, and more. Here's the interesting part. These viruses need a nutrient called arginine to thrive, like a special food. But arginine competes with lysine. By giving your body enough lysine, you block arginine, starving the viruses. Take 1,000 to 3,000 milligrams of lysine daily for a while to put the viruses back to sleep, paired with stress reduction in every way possible. If you're still with me, drop your city's name in the comments to let me know you're here. But viruses aren't the only threat damaging the protective coating around your nerves. There's something even more fundamental. The key nutrient supporting myelin, the protective coating around your nerves, is vitamin B12. This is another nerve issue you need to know about. If you're low on B12, you might feel electric shocks in your nervous system, intense pain, or numbness. Why? Because B12 helps build the myelin sheath, the outer layer shielding your nerves. Think of myelin like the insulation around electrical wires in your home. If it's damaged, electricity leaks, sparking danger. Similarly, the myelin sheath insulates nerves, letting signals flow smoothly. Without enough B12, this shield weakens, and nerve signals misfire causing sensations like electric shocks or uncomfortable tingling. This isn't just bothersome. It can be painful and seriously affect your quality of life. Speaking of nerve signals, there's a common workplace injury most don't realize is linked to a vitamin deficiency. Next up is carpal tunnel syndrome, a problem in your wrist. Many think it's just from typing or repetitive work, but it's often due to low vitamin B6. Carpal tunnel happens when a nerve running through a small tunnel in your wrist gets compressed. You'll feel numbness, sharp pain, or weakness in your hand and fingers, 
especially at night. Here's the fascinating part. Low B6 can cause the tissues around this nerve to swell and inflame, like skin puffing up after a burn. Instead of jumping to surgery or braces, try boosting B6 first. Many see their symptoms improve significantly just by fixing this deficiency. While carpal tunnel affects your hands, another nerve pain can stop you from walking. Let's talk about sciatica, often caused by disc issues in your spine. Many with disc problems lack copper. Copper is vital for keeping spinal discs and surrounding connective tissues strong. Low copper can weaken discs, making them prone to degeneration, which may compress the sciatic nerve, the large nerve running from your back to your legs. If you have sciatica, try adding copper supplements or apply copper cream directly to the painful area of your back for relief. Many are amazed at how effective this simple approach can be. If you're still watching, drop a 1 in the comments to let me know you're with me. But what will shock you is that all these issues pale compared to the most common nerve problem, one that's entirely preventable. Now, let's tackle the most common nerve issue out there, one tied to prediabetes or diabetes. Many people with diabetes end up with nerve problems in their feet. They feel numbness in their toes first. Then it spreads across the foot. The soles become painful. Here's what's happening. High blood sugar creates a huge demand for a vitamin called B1 or thiamine. I recommend taking it as benfotiamine, which penetrates the myelin sheath and reaches nerves quickly, rapidly reversing nerve damage caused by high sugar. The simple rule is, the more carbs or sugar you eat, the more B1 you need. If you're prediabetic or diabetic, with lots of sugar in your blood, you'll need even more B1 to compensate. Of course, cutting out sugar might be an even better fix. But benfotiamine, a fat-soluble form of B1, is the best antidote for peripheral neuropathy, as B1 is essential for carbohydrate metabolism. One crucial note, for B1 to work, you need another cofactor, magnesium. As we've explored today, nerve issues aren't mysterious conditions. They're your body's way of signaling specific nutrient gaps. Now it's your turn. Have you experienced any of these nerve problems or tried any of the vitamins we discussed? Maybe you've tested one of these approaches and seen results? Drop your story in the comments below. I believe your body is an amazing self-healing system. It just needs the right tools. Sometimes, the simplest solutions are the most effective. If this video helped you, please like, share, and subscribe to Golden Vitality, where we turn complex health science into practical solutions you can use every day to build a healthier life together. Check out the suggested videos below to learn more about other natural health approaches. And we'll see you in the next episode.